Is it far? Not very. Just through this port now. What if Shoreline set up an ambush by the plane? They didn't. And what makes you so sure? Because they're heading to the mountain for the treasure. <clears throat> She is. It's a long drop. How did you get here? I hopped down a few of these walls, but I guess we'll have to find another way around. Jump down from up there. It's too high to get it back up. Yeah, maybe there's something we can put under it. Give me a hand, Sam. All right. Thanks. We got it. Hey guys, through here. Whoa, check that thing out. It's like a sky rail or something. Think it still works? to sleep in my own bed again. So close, yet so far. No controls, but I bet I could pull the platform with my rope. 
are you doing, kid? Uh, I'm not sure yet. Maybe if you could get to that wooden platform down there. Good <laughs> idea. Nathan, give me a hand. Okay. Okay, Victor, can I borrow you for a sec? Sure. All right, go ahead, Nathan. There, we'll hold it down, you jump across. You're not gonna drop me, are you? Tempting, but no. Oh, whoa, 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 what the hell are you doing? Hey, don't mess around, kid. I'm just testing the weight. Okay, we're ready. Well, this is some impressive engineering for a bunch of pirates. This is nothing. You should have seen the. Whoa! Hang on! Oh. You guys all right? Yeah. It's like a roller coaster. Come on up, Nate. Nathan, you climb on up. I'll grab you. Go! Jump off, quick! Nathan, give me a hand. There you go. Sam! Oh, bitch. Sam, come on! Huh? Right. Come on, just jump, I'll catch you. Let's go. No. No, no, don't you even think about it, you hear me? I'm sorry I got you into this. All of you. Hey, all that doesn't matter anymore, okay? Just, just jump. I gotta see this thing through, Nathan. Sam. Hey, listen to me. If you do this, I'm not coming after you. You hear me? I'm sorry. Sam. Sam! Oh, stupid, stupid. You called your bluff. He's gonna get himself killed. Come on. She's, she's probably right. Of course she is. Let's go. Up here. Maybe we can head him off. I'm gonna save him, and then I'm gonna punch him. All right, let's just worry about the saving part first. What the hell is he thinking? <clears throat> After everything that we... Wasn't this enough? <sighs> let's just find him. Hey, we can get over that wall with this. <clears throat> Come on! Here, we got you. I got it. 
Now, how the hell are we supposed to get up there? We don't have enough time. Nate? No, not by yourself. Look, I'll come right back, okay? Look, he is not gonna leave without a fight. Yeah, well, then I'll fight him if I have to, but either way, I'm bringing him back. Just get the plane as close to the mountain as you can and be ready for a quick getaway. Like there's another kind? It's not fair. Doing the dishes, we take turns. Don't even think about not coming back. <laughs> I love you. Same to you, cowboy. Damn it. I'm sure he's a ways off by now. Just gonna head to the creepy mountain, save Sam, get the hell out of here. Yeah. Be laughing about the whole thing tomorrow. Back on the trail. The footprints end here. Oh, come on, which way did he go? on the trail. to your death, so still get a chance to kill you. Jesus Christ. but no cigar, pal. Almost at the finish line. Got the best of you. Uh. Uh. 
<laughs> More footprints. Well, in we go. Hey, Sam! There you are. Sam, if Rafe and Nadine don't kill you, I just might. This is so much harder than it looks. I guess this is my way down. down.
guess this is my way down. Did you really do all that, Sam? Uh, I doubt it. You probably found the dry way down. Less painful way down. Done here? This is the last of them, ma'am. Good. If we are here, we can catch up with the others. <sighs> Sam just stole our goddamn boat. He's headed for Avery's ship. Come on. Let him. We're done. We're done. Most of my men are dead, Rafe. And those who aren't have already left. Can you see that? The end is literally in sight. That maniac pirate of yours has rigged this entire cave. I'm not setting foot on his ship. Nadine, if you cut and run right now, the loss of all your men, everything that we've done, is for nothing. We have millions in gold right here. I'd say that plus our lives is something. No wonder so many of your men abandoned you. Excuse me? We're on the verge of making history here, and you're willing to just walk off with a pittance, a fraction of what Sam's gonna get from that boat. If he can walk away from that ship alive, he can have it. Hell, I'd say he's earned it. God knows you didn't. Now look, we can stand here and insult each other all day, or we can finish what it is that we've done. <laughs> Oh, we're finishing it all right. Sorry, ma'am. Yeah. Thing about mercenaries, Nadine, their loyalty, it's bought. It's not earned. Now, come on. Either we can finish this thing together, or we can just end it right here. Let's go make history. And a girl. By all means. <laughs> See what you have in store for us, Captain Avery.
Nate? Where is Sam? Oh, he's right there. Sam? Relax, he's alive. Well, this idiot nearly got us all killed. I'm getting him out of here. No, you're not. Rafe, you can have the treasure, all right? Just let me save my brother. <laughs> <laughs> After everything he's done? How noble of you, but no. If we stay here any longer, and we're all dead. Is that what you want? It's not what I said. What do you think, Nadine? <coughs> Good to see you up and about. Be a deer and relieve Nate there of his gun. Hand it over. You really think you can trust him? Huh? Not your concern. Now, why are you trying to instigate? Nate? Nadine and I are our partners. I don't screw over my partners. Get over there. You and your brother, though. Right from the start, you took advantage of my generosity. You tried to cut me out, and it's high time you learn. What are you doing? Now you give me your gun. <laughs> Nadine? I won't ask you again. You are being profoundly stupid right now. Look over there. Nadine, stop screwing around. Jesus! I said look! Okay, it's a couple of skeletons. So what? I don't know as much about history as you boys, but I've got a pretty good idea who those two are. Well, enlighten us. It's Avery and two. They killed each other. Good for them. What's the point? Everyone obsessed with this treasure gets what they deserve. So what, you're just leaving us here to die? Oh, I'm just leaving. Whether you die or not, I don't really care. Nadine, wait. So long, Rafe. Nadine! Nadine! You open this goddamn door right now! Rafe, she's gone! Come on, give me a hand, we'll all get out of here. Won't work. Come on, help me with Sam and I'll help you open the door. No, I'm not going to be able to enjoy one of these coins. Knowing that you and your worthless brother are still sucking air. Hey, just, just calm down. You can practice your fencing when we get outside. Nate, just shut up. Seriously, Rafe, this is insane, even for you. You want to... Ah! Ah! You interrupted me. Don't do it again. Now, where was I? Ah. You want to hear insane? Nathan Drake raced a madman and his entire army to the steps of Shamba. Jesus! I said don't interrupt me.
Seriously, Rafe, this is insane, even for you. You want to hear insane? Nathan Drake raced a madman and his entire army to the steps of Shambhala. Oh, Jesus! Nathan Drake found the lost city in the middle of the Rub al Kali desert. God damn it. Come on, we can get out of here together. Nathan Drake. Nathan God. Drake discovered the fable, El Dorado. Jesus. Come on, Rafe. Stop. Nathan Drake is a legend. <laughs> you know, I... I shot the man who told me that. Look, I get it. You don't like me very much. You know, for all your greatness, Nate, you have nothing. You are nothing. And I warned you to get out of my way. I have sacrificed everything to find Avery, and I'm not gonna let a couple of stupid thieves, a senile con man, and a washed up journalist take that away from me! It's been fun. Sacrificed everything to find Avery, and I'm not gonna let a couple of stupid thieves, a senile con man, and a washed up journalist take that away from me! You care about that parade of losers so much, I'm going to make sure they join you. On guard, dickhead. That's the spirit. You know how to... Ah. Sword's still sharp. Oh, shit. I will trust that, Nate. Hmm? 
Disappointed, eh? Stay in burn with the ship, you'd be my guest. You got me. You know what, Nate? Underneath all the bravado, you're just a sad little boy with delusions of grandeur. Who, by the way, can't fence for shit. So long, Nathan Drake. Nathan! You don't know what to give up. That's good. Don't hand it to me. I had everything handed to me on a goddamn silver platter. Learn this. All of it. You want the treasure, Rafe? It's all yours. Holy shit! Hey, come on, let's get you out of here. It's too heavy. Strike it. Try again! It's no use. Oh, come on! Nathan! Damn it! Listen to me. Listen to me. All I ever wanted to do was find this treasure with you. Hey, sure. We did it. We did it, brother, okay? It's all right. There's gonna be another way. Nathan, you gotta go. There's gonna be some. Gotta go! This comes! There is no other way! Come on, Nathan. I gotta know you made it out all right. 
then the whole place is about to blow up! That's it! That's it! The hell you don't! Stress me! God damn it! Let's get your head down! Yeah, I think so. Yeah, feel free to sell anything I left behind. <laughs> sure, I can't give you a lift home. After the last few days, I think I'd like a plane with drink service and reclining seats. Plus, uh, she and I have a lot to talk about. Yeah, you do. And no more late night phone calls about one last time. <laughs> <laughs> Promise. Thanks, Sally. Take care, kid. Don't be a stranger. Next time you're in town, beers are on me. I'll hold you to that. <laughs> and then the bunny escapes anyway, and it leaves little bunny surprises all over the headmaster's bed. Hey, 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 <laughs> what are you telling her? Just about your little magic phase. Oh, I hate you. What was your stage name? Go on, tell her. Nate the Great. <laughs> it's not funny, it makes sense. In his defense, he was actually, you were pretty good. Uh-huh. <laughs> Hey, look, Sam, it has been an experience getting to meet you. But the handshake? Well... Bring it in for the real thing, sister. You take care of this gnome skull, all right? Yeah, I will. I'll join you in a sec. Yeah. I like her. God help her, she sure seems to love you. <laughs> I know, right? Listen, the offer still stands. I appreciate it, but I'm good. I know, but if you feel like you're imposing, it's, you're not. We not talked about, about it. It's not about that. It's a little bit of that, okay? Yeah. But I just kind of thought that after we found Avery's treasure, I'd be satisfied. Uh -huh. Instead, I've uh, <laughs> kind of left with this strange feeling of emptiness. Yeah. Yeah, well, you know, as thrilling as the next adventure might be, in the end, I always left with that same feeling. And sometimes you just gotta choose what you're gonna keep and what you're gonna let go. Well, I guess I'm just not there yet. And besides, 
You know, you've got a few ancient cities on me. I can't let that slide. So. Yeah, I left a couple out there. Well, thank you. <laughs> oh, that's... That's our ride. Yeah. Uh... Sam. I've come far. You sure have, little brother. Come here. Listen, you don't do anything I wouldn't do, all right? Get out of here, vamos. <laughs> Right. Yeah. So, Victor, what's next for you? Hmm? Hmm. <laughs> well, before I got dragged into this, I was working on a business deal of sorts. Of sorts? Hmm. Dangerous? Yeah. With these people, yeah. It's up there. Well, I just so happen to know a certain someone recently out of prison who might be perfect for this kind of work. Ooh, I don't know. Is he trustworthy? More or less. As is Portuguese. Quando seu marido volta para casa? What's that mean? How long before your husband gets home? <laughs> That'll do. Come on. You got any more of those cigars? Don't push your luck. <sighs> hey, good morning. Indeed it is. Indeed it is. Ah. All right, I'll bite. What's going on? Land a big contract or something? Oh, even better. I'm on the verge of selling Jameson Marine. No kidding? Yeah. Wow, that... Well, hey, I guess, I guess congratulations are in order, huh? Well, not yet, but I'm confident it'll go through. They drove a hard bargain, but in the end, I think we came to a mutually beneficial agreement. That's that's great. Are, are you gonna stay on? No, 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 no. I think I'd like to just relax, hang with the family, go fishing every chance I get. <laughs> Good for you. <laughs> so who's the sap who's gonna buy this place? Oh, uh, you are. <laughs> what? <laughs> no, come on, seriously. Oh, yeah, seriously. <laughs> Wait, Jameson. Hey, wait, wait up, man. Hey, morning, guys. What are you doing here? Just thought I'd take, you know, one final look. Already gave your husband the keys. Okay. Perfect. Is, is this for real? Nate, all you need to know is that you'd be making a very wise investment. Do the right thing here. Call me when you're through. You got it. Hi. Hi. You're, you're buying Jameson Marine? We are buying Jameson Marine. Oh. Okay. How? Why? Well, I heard this rumor about a salvage job off the coast of Malaysia, and I thought it would be right up no, our no, alley. No, Honey, look. We barely got out of the Britannia alive. Yeah. Hey, taking an illegal job? You know what that leads to. Who said it was illegal? <laughs> Look. This came in this morning. Is this legit? Yeah. Some of my old contacts out there, they worked their magic with the Malaysian permit office. <laughs> it was great. I didn't even have to bribe anyone. Well, that's good, because I don't know how we could possibly even afford to do this. Here. Hold out your hand. What? Hold out your hand. Come on. Holy crap. Where did you get this? It was in my jacket pocket. 
along with a bunch more. A bunch? Sam. He's a sneaky <laughs> one. Yeah. Of course, most of them are gonna have to go into our venture here, along with all the new camera gear. Camera gear? Yeah. You know, I figured as we're pulling all the cargo up from the dive, we could hire, you know, a small crew. We could film the whole thing and resurrect my old show. What happened to just living a normal life? I think in our attempt to lead a normal life, we may have oversteered. Look, when I was on that island, I missed the adventure. I missed us. And so now we have a chance to do what we love. But from here on out, we are gonna operate on a strictly legal basis, all right? And I will be doing all of the shooting with my really expensive camera. Wow. You've really thought all this through, haven't you? More or less. But listen, just say the word and I will call the whole thing off. What? Oh, no, 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 no. I, I don't want to be that guy who ruins Jameson's early retirement like that. That'd be cruel. Right. <laughs> it's not gonna be easy, you know. Nothing worthwhile is. So, what do you say, Nathan Drake? Sure, why not? Hmm. Yeah, as long as I don't have to do any paperwork. <laughs> well, I can't do it. I'm gonna have my hands full with the camera. Well, I'm gonna have my hands full with all the diving. Okay, fine. We'll take turns. Yeah. Or... I could play for it. Seriously? No, listen, I have been practicing. I'm getting good. No. My hand eye is way I better than it used to be. Really? <laughs> I cannot do that to you again. Are you afraid to play me? I am so not afraid. On a to scale play of you. one to ten, how scared are you to play me? Like a three. Yeah, well, jack that up to like eleven, all oh, right? Because uh, I'm coming for you. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Oh, my. That's. Okay. Fine. You're on.
Mom? Dad? Anyone? Oh, that looks beautiful. Hmm. <laughs> Sorry, Sully. Wow, Sam looks so young. So cool. I need to ask mom to borrow this one again. I think they abandoned us. Sam and Sully are coming to visit. <laughs> Look at these two. She goes. Taj Mahal, here I come. Just a few more weeks. Is the rest of our boat crew. Anyone? No? Nothing? Okay. Hey, Vicky. Okay, girl, where's mom and dad? All right, go find them. Go! Really? 
Fine, I'll find it myself. Mm, the food's all here. Not here either. Okay, I well, guess I'll just wait then. You figured it out. Whoa. Good job cleaning this up. The search area narrowed down quite a bit. Oh, yeah, I was hanging out with Soli for this one. <laughs> I remember that one. Oh, this was definitely my favorite dig. <laughs> Look at you all bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. Goofy. Hmm. He left his keys. He left his keys. Kind of creepy. Kind of cool. Hello. Gunsway heist? Wait, did you go looking for Avery's treasure? Magna. Greatness from small beginnings. Huh. 
Hmm. What's this? What the hell? Oh shit. Hey, there you are. Hey. Been looking for you. What are you doing in here? Uh, looking for you guys. Come on, we loaded up the boat. It's ready. Cool. I'll catch up with you guys in a sec. Why? Uh, I just need to, um... Uh, What's get... up, Cassie? Okay. Don't be mad. Hey, I said don't be mad. Keys. <sighs> so, what did you see? Nothing really. Well, just that photo of you two and Sully. With a bunch of Spanish looking treasure. And a shotgun. Yeah. Huh. This is bound to happen sometime. Maybe we should just tell her. She's not ready for it. Ready for what? All that crazy shit in there? Language. Yeah, language. Sorry. But you guys are literally keeping skeletons in your closet. Or at least a silver skull of some kind. You know, I don't think I'm ready for this. Really. Nate, it's time to have the talk. Mm. Yeah, it's totally time. Wait, which talk are we talking about here? She's just a kid. She's older than you and Sam when you started That's, all of this. That is different, and you know it. Okay, look, if you guys were into some shady stuff, it's totally cool. <laughs> but I think I'm old enough to know about it, right? Old enough? How old are you again? Ha, uh, funny. Mom? All right. Well, let's see. Um, for me, it started when this guy called me up with a scoop on a massive historical find. <laughs> it sounded like a complete fraud. Yeah, handsome fraud. No, I hadn't even met him yet. Oh, she knew. <laughs> she knew. So this fraud says, if you fund the trip, then I'll give you the coffin of Sir Francis Drake. And for the record, I totally delivered. <laughs> yeah, you delivered us into the hands of Indonesian pirates. No, oh, come on. You know I had nothing to do okay, with that. Okay, guys, time out. You're saying that you were attacked by pirates after you found the coffin of Sir Francis Drake. Is that right? Yeah, yeah that, pretty that's pretty much right. it, yeah. Bullshit. Language. Language. Crap. Better. All right, so keep going. You know what? The sun is up, boat's ready, wind is just right. You want to continue the story? I say we do it on the water. Come on. Well, wait, what did Francis Drake look like? Was it gross? Actually, he wasn't in there. Yeah, just his journal with a map to El Dorado. The city of gold? Uh, that's the legend. Turns out it was just a statue, a cursed statue. No way, seriously? Yeah, seriously. But uh, I'll get back to that later. See, the map led us to the
Is it far? Not very. Is it far? <laughs> Not very. Just through this port. What if Shoreline set up an ambush by the plane? Hey, Digger. And what makes you so sure?